Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahweh Shai, Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahweh Shai, Barakat the Yahweh, by Shim Yahweh Shai, by Shim, Racha Hakwadash. Um, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, and Shalom to the hopeful elect -like brothers, all right, who believe in this word and who fear in the Heavenly Father and His Son. Um, this is just going to be a, uh, a quick in transit video. And, um, you know, basically, uh, you know, I was watching the, uh, the brother Amawan Gabar, um, you know, you know, he entitled his video, uh, I believe what the, the chariots, um, are going to reveal themselves, you know, the chariots are going to reveal themselves because, you know, and, and and they are, you know, revealing themselves, but they're going to reveal themselves even more. You know, in the modern day technology, people have the ability to uh, to videotape. All right. To catch on video, the different so-called uh, phenomena in the skies, man. Right. And many people are seeing chariots firsthand, so you can't hide it. You know, this is why Esau had to uh, come out with a report about these different um, uh, celestial vehicles, or what they like to call extra ex extraterrestrial. You know, because you know they, uh, you know, there's so many. Um, uh, from a report, uh, what is it? One of the government officials who actually. He studies that he was hired by the government to study these uh, the chariots, and he, you know, he basically said every day, every day there are um, multiple sightings and reports that come that come across his desk every day. You know, and I believe the most the uh, the most uh, frequent chariot sightings. Are in the United States, America, right? So, yeah, man. Hey, right now, a hey, peep, you know, brothers and see brothers see chariots also see different things. Um, you know, some of those videos we watch could be CGI, you know, but that that still it still goes to stand that a hey, people are seeing these vehicles. If they weren't, then. Esau would would wouldn't uh, have to do a report on it, right? We know through the scriptures that those so-called UFOs or UAPs, right? Those are the vehicles of the Heavenly Father, His Son, and the angels, right? Just like you know, Jake can uh, have a nice Mercedes or a nice uh, vehicle to ride in in style. So does the Most High. Right, the scriptures, um, Isaiah 63, it says, Who is this that cometh from Edom with thy gar uh, garments from Basra? Okay, um, this that is glorious in his apparel, traveling in the greatness of his strength, right? So the Lord is going to come back with great glory and, 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 uh, and, and elegance and you know, majesty, man, right. And those chariots are going to be a part of that what? That great glory, right? He's going to come back decked out. He's going to have the best, most, biggest uh, chariot, all right? That's going to be on the face of the earth when he returns, you know? You know, so that's going to be a part of that glory that's coming right now. Um, there's been certain, uh, you know, footage, I'll say, where, where basically, um, uh, a chariot morphed or disguised itself as a plane, you know, it, it disguised itself as a plane, um, chariots basically, uh, maxed themselves in the clouds right um opening portals and 
going, you know, going up in the portals, different, you know, different um, footage scene, right? We know, uh, you know, uh, a portion of it is CGI, you know, it's uh, made up, right? Which, uh, you know, E has the technology to try and mimic, right? Or try and uh, copy uh, the different things that the actual chariots do in the skies that are amazing. So, you know, that's also another thing to keep in mind. You know, this devil has uh, witchcraft, you know, and deceit in his uh, technology to do these particular things. So, you know, but uh, saying all that goes to show you because, you know, he put a, uh, the elder, um, the, the big bro, uh, uh, Amawan Gabar, right? He put a, um, a uh, you know, his, his camera out on the, the clouds because, you know, it's a nice little, you know, uh, array of clouds in the sky, you know, and you never know which we know what that the angels of the lord are around all the time right especially those that fear him okay we but uh, you know i believe uh we believe that the angels are among us throughout our day-to-day uh, -day lives that's why we're able to you know do these edifying videos and to you know think think and think upon the name of the lord and his words and the prophecies that's why we're able to do these particular things right so with that being said you know, that's why we're able to do these particular things so with that being said you know you never know you know in in each uh uh city or area where there's people you never know uh how many chariots the lord just have just have up there you know maybe with a cloaking device invisible right or if it's a cloudy day how many of those clouds are actually chariots man right you never know so when the lord starts revealing you know the chariots start revealing themselves more hey you're gonna see what would you know hey you're gonna see what was uh you know the angels that you, uh, pe people are going to start to see the, the presence of the angels that wasn't um, previously known, right? Us that are in the truth, we are, we're aware of the presence of the angels, you know? And, so, and, and at times, the angels will make their presence uh, more uh, known, man. More, uh, let's say, more evident, right? But we're aware that the angels are everywhere. You know, the eyes of the Lord are 10,000 times brighter than the sun. Behoving the evil and the good The eyes of the Lord are the angels Right? And they behold everything So we're aware Of the presence of the angels And at times they make their presence More evident Or they might cause, you know They might come down in the form of a man And the spirit may alert you that Hey, this is an angel They may um, appear to you as an apparition Right? I've, I've you know I've had that happen to me before, um, you know, and that's it, and that's on that's on both sides, man. You know, on the right hand and the left hand, right. But particularly talking about the righteous angels, right? All right, the angels on the on the right hand, right? They might appear or show their show their presence via a chariot, you know, whether it be an orb. That is not flying like the a drone or usual vehicle, whether it be uh, actual distinctive characteristics of a, you know, <laughs> a, 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 a weird uh, shape, you know, whether it be you know like a metallic, you know, uh, one time I, I seen a I seen one that was it was it was shiny like it was shiny like silver, you know. You can literally see the see the, the the sun gleaming off of it in the distance, and then it disappeared before my eyes. So you're gonna uh, hey, the world is gonna see more things like that. We're gonna see more things like that. Okay, it's coming, man. The Lord is gonna make His presence even more known. 
You know, and that, you know, Elder Apostle Gabar um, did a video like that. Not not Gabar, Salakia, Salakia. Elder uh, Kazak. And excuse me, brothers, it's, it's, uh, it's early. I, did, I woke up not too, uh, not too long ago. Um, and the past couple of days has been very uh, tiring and, you know, feeling a little worn out. But, uh, yeah, so um, the elder Kazak down in Mississippi, you know, did a video a while back on, you know, of course, we have to wait for the, uh, the MOTB to take effect, right? But Esau might try to speed things up either because of, you know, uh, brothers might receive spiritual power and increase to where it's evident that, you know, these particular men are the men of the Lord, okay? You know, or, you know, the Lord could have angels actually come and, you know, commune with the brethren uh, face to face. Who, who knows what may make this devil speed up? Because one thing is this, this devil is seeing, he sees the different things in the heavens, in the outer space and in the upper atmosphere of the earth. He sees these different things, right? He monitors these different things. So something, you know, is going to happen to where the Lord is going to is going to put the spirit on him to make haste. Whether that be brothers receiving spiritual power or whether that be brothers, uh, you know, or the, the angels making themselves even more, um, even more, uh, 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 their presence more known or, or what have you. You know, because something's gonna happen in the spirit where this devil's gonna be like, we, we 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 can't wait no longer. Okay, we have to. We can no longer wait. We have to implement this and make it mandatory. You know, and that that could be one of the cases, right? Like the scriptures say, um, Revelations twelve and uh, Revelations twelve and verse um, twelve. Right, right. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil has come down unto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth he hath but a short time. So something's gonna happen where it's gonna signify in his mind, like, oh man, we we have to do this now. We gotta do it now, or we won't be. Able, if it if it goes on, if time goes on, we won't be able to do it. We gotta do it now. Right, he's gonna be all in. He's gonna be all in. We got, we gotta finish this, this NWO. All right, this new, this new uh, system of, uh, of um, what's it? This new system of power that we have planned. It has to be set up now, and that's coming. You know, that's coming. Cause right now, you know, things, <clears throat> things are speeding up. You know, uh, things are switching to the digital side now, but you know, for uh, for right now, um, you know, things are not like they're not mandatory. Let's say they're not mandatory, right? It has to get you know, you know, people, uh, you know, are going to be given the choice to take it. Right, but under the guise of um, to take the uh, the karagma, but under the guise of it being beneficial to them, uh, medical uh, uh, medical benefits, um, <clears throat> he's gonna be you know you know security benefits, right? Enhancement of your so-called enhancement of your mind and of your own body benefits, right? So. Hey, that's gonna come before he makes it mandatory. He's gonna, you know, try to, you know, 
give it a good reputation. It's like, oh, you could do this and do that, and use and use celebrities to basically push it to get other people to take it. So, hey, man, that's that's what's gonna be coming, man. You know, that's what's gonna be coming, right? But you know, nevertheless, you know, the the, the angels are definitely gonna be um, making their presence more known. Okay, via the chariots, as we see it in prophecy, right? His glory it covered the sky, right? The Lord cometh, uh, um, with the thousands of heavens, right? That man waxed strong with the thousands of heavens. It's coming. Every eye shall see him, right? It's going to be on every news channel. Um, hey, man, it's it's coming, man. The Lord, the Lord is about to show out, as as as, as brothers say, right? He's going to show out, right? He's going to show his power and his presence via those chariots. So, you know, Lord will, uh, you know, this little bit was edifying. And with that, I'm going to say all praises to y'all. And uh, shalom.